Hi, it's Ari from RSVPFI here to take you on a brief video tour of the core features of our platform. Your event website has two parts, the event wall on the left and event registration or RSVP form on the right. Your events website will scale automatically to mobile devices. You can also choose to hide the event wall completely and make your form full page. To get started, enter some basic information about your event. Choose to have a simple yes, no, or maybe reply, or choose to have multiple ticket types or sessions for invitees to choose from. Next, select a pre-made template as a starting point. You can then customize everything, including colors, styles, images, text, fonts, email confirmations, and much more. After you've created your event, you'll be able to start customizing your RSVP or registration form. Click into text blocks to add your text or images. Drag and drop form blocks to your form. Click the gear icons to customize individual blocks and settings. You can add custom questions to the form, collect meal preferences, ask guests to RSVP to secondary events, and much more. Click the update form theme button to customize your form's colors and styles. On the left, you can find all of the options to view your registrations and configure and customize your event. Click the View Event button to preview how your event website and forms look and what guests will see. Your dashboard offers an overview of all of your guests' replies. You can view guest details, breakdowns of various replies and questions, filter, and export all of your data to a spreadsheet. Under the Setup section, you can customize your event wall to showcase details about your event. Add and reorder blocks on your wall. Click in text blocks to edit text or add images. Also under the Setup section, you can return to the form builder that we saw earlier anytime to make updates or add new form blocks. Click Event Settings to manage other options like basic event details, security settings, confirmation emails, automatic reminders, language customizations, and more. If you'd like to send email invitations to invitees through RSVPFI or limit who can register for your event, you can create an invite list. You can import your invitees from a spreadsheet or add invitees manually, no imports required. When you add invitees, you'll be asked to set your event as private and invite only, or you can leave it public so anyone can register. When you're ready to launch, head to the Publish and Invite section to publish your event. Here you can also choose to embed your form on another website or download a QR code for invitees to scan to start their RSVP or registration. In the Email section, you can build and send email invitations, updates, or reminders. You'll be able to customize email styling, content, images, and logos. Select an audience to receive your email and choose to send immediately or schedule for a future date and time. You'll find a bunch more powerful features and customization options throughout the RSVPFI experience.